Hello and welcome to Moai 3D for Beginners. As the name implies, this is a series dedicated to complete beginners that want to learn the software, the interface, the tools, and also start creating basic shapes. Let's start by describing Moai 3D. Moai is an hybrid CAD NURBS modeling software made with artists and designers in mind, which means it is uh, very easy to use, the interface is uh, quite simple and uh, it allows you to iterate very fast because you don't have the limitation of polygons. If you are a 3D artist, uh, concept artist or concept designer, this is the ideal companion to your main 3D package. Let's take a look at the interface. When you open Moai for the first time, this will be your default interface. In the center here, you have the viewport. Right now is set to four views. You have top 3D, front and right. On the bottom here, you have various options. You have your usual file menu with the list of the recent projects, as well as the possibility to open various projects, importing models here. You can save your project, create a new one, and of course, export your scene or your model. Then you have a quick save uh, button here, undo, redo, delete, and you have the buttons for uh, changing the view. So right now I'm in the split view mode. If I click 3D, you go to the 3D, front, right, and so on. Then we have uh, this uh, blank spaces here with some values. Now the first box, it is basically the position of your cursor in the space. So I, if, I, if I move the mouse, you can see that the numbers changes. This box with the D letter means length. It is very powerful because if you draw a line like this, as you can see, I can uh, uh, move the mouse wherever I want and the line will follow. But let's say I want it to be 15 units long. What I can do is uh, clicking here, write 15, enter. And now you can see that the length of the line doesn't change. The next box is for the degrees. So if I say 45 degrees, I can only rotate the line by 45 degrees increment. So it is very powerful, but don't worry. We'll take a look at all these options in the following videos. Then you have these three other buttons. These are for the snapping options. You have your usual grid snap, stay snap, object snap, but uh, again, we'll take a look at them in the following videos. You have the options menu here to change various options. Help will open the local Moai documentation on your hard drive. Then you have the right sidebar here. This contains all the tools and the operations you can do. Various curves, solids, the various views, uh, trimming options. But in any case, I will talk about all these operations in another video. Browser, if you click here on the bottom right, this will show you all the objects you have in the scene, surfaces, curves, etc. You can uh, select them by clicking here. Like now I don't have anything. And then uh, the materials. Styles, just the name of Moai for materials. However, Moai doesn't really have rendering capabilities. Uh, so if you want to render your uh, model, you will have to export it to another uh, application. And that's it for the interface. As you can see, it's very, very simple and straightforward. You just have a viewport, some buttons here, and uh, your sidebar with the tools. In the next video, we are going to take a look at the navigation. In the meantime, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like if that's the case. Subscribe to so stay up to date with the latest content. If you have any questions, comment below. And I'll see you in the next one.